So we have two more speakers for you this afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. And next to speak is Pravin from Swa Life. Please welcome Pravin. Plants are the major source of novel compound. About 83% of drug in the market are from natural origin. We have developed a technology that have isolated novel small molecules from plant that have shown protective activity against sun damage and also effective as anti-cancer drug. We are, team of, sorry, we are a team of two experts. Well, my name is Praveen Bade. I'm a founder and CEO. I'm a pharmacist with PhD in life science, and my co-founder is doing his PhD in nanoparticles and expertise in cancer biology, cell biology, immunology, and drug delivery. For the last four years, we are isolating different novel compounds from plant and targeting DNA damage in different diseases. When skin is exposed to UV, it produces DNA damage, which leads to skin damage. To protect from this damage, people apply sunscreen. And how does the sunscreen work? Just like this. It shields your skin from UV rays, which is good but it completely blocks vitamin D production, and vitamin D is critical to life. To overcome this problem, we have formulated a novel natural midnight sunscreen that protects your skin from UV rays and also gives you daily dose of vitamin D. It is an antioxidant and 100% natural. The good thing is that you apply at night to get your daily dose of vitamin D, and in daytime, it protects from UV rays. We have also formulated natural anti-aging cream that enhances the collagen production in the skin. And the third product is natural skin repair cream that enhances the DNA repair process. The, cosmic, the skincare market is growing enormously, reaching a sale up to $130 billion by 2090. In four months' time at Rebel Bio, we have formulated three products and negotiating a sale contract with a cosmetic industry company in Ireland. We have signed an open innovation platform agreement with Leo Pharma to test our novel compounds in their platform. Next month, we will be doing regulatory assays with collaborating with ITC Lab. And the following month, we will start bulk manufacturing of our skincare product. In 18 months' time, we will have our skincare product and we will optimize the small molecules for anti cancer drug. To achieve our goal, we are asking for 550K for 18 months' operation, mostly used on RD and upscaling of our skincare product. We will use nature to protect your skin from harmful effects of UV rays. Thank you. Fascinating, Pravin. I mean, I, I can't bear keep putting sunscreen on. It's the most laborious, boring thing to have to do. <laughs> so you're saying you can you can take this thing at night and be protected. Yeah. So you. The following day. Yeah. So you apply at night, and it will get absorbed in the body. So that will provide you your vitamin D and also protect from the damaging effect of UV, yeah. because the uh, free radical produced by UV will be uh, uh, treated by our cream. Yeah, because as a British person, I don't like going out in the sun at all. And I think <laughs> that's the problem, isn't it? I'm not getting enough vitamin D. It's bad for my bones. It's bad for my gums. It's bad for my mood. It's bad for everything, right? Yeah. So this not only protects the skin, but skin. also gives you the vitamin D. Yeah, and also like people like us who, are not <laughs> who, who need more uh, exposure to UV, but because of our skin, you can still apply this cream and get vitamin D. Amazing. So. Yeah. I think most uh, dietitians say that uh, of all the supplements that people constantly buy in this country, vitamin D is the only one only. that the average British person does need. And I think cases of rickets are increasing at the moment because people use so much sun cream Sunscreen. and we don't get enough sun. Any I mean, rickets is like a Victorian yeah, illness it, that's coming back. Yeah, I mean, so you apply sunscreen, you know, the layer you have seen in the slide, you know, you have to apply that much amount to get protected. Yeah. And it, every two hours you are applying that. So mm. it's... Uh, 
And is it true to say some of the compounds in sunscreen can be quite harmful and yeah, they're quite they are, toxic? Yeah. Some of the sunscreen compounds are toxic, so... So you'll be avoiding that as well? Avoiding that one by using our natural compounds. Oh, that's lovely. Thank you very much Thanks. indeed. Well done.